So did you break up with Joanna? I think so. That's a good thing you got out when you did, before she blew up like that Vesuvius. The volcano? Yeah. And speaking of volcanoes, man, are they a violent igneous rock formation. What? Oh, yeah, lava spewing, hot ash. Of course, some are dormant. Okay, Mom, why are you talking about volcanoes all of a sudden? Well, we can talk about something else. What do you want to talk about? Vivisection? The vast difference? <laughs> The Vietnam War. Oh, did anybody see that, that documentary on the Korean War? Oh, oh yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Look, I studied karate for a long time. <laughs> and there's a concept you should really be familiar with. It's what the Japanese call unagi. Kind of sushi? No, it's a concept. Yeah, it is, it is. It's freshwater eels. <laughs> All right, maybe it means that too. Oh, I would kill for a salmon skin roll right now. <laughs> no, fine, get attacked. I don't even care. <laughs> Come on, Ross. We're sorry. Please tell us what it is. Unagi <laughs> is a state of total awareness. Okay, only by achieving true unagi can you be prepared for any danger that may befall you. You mean in case someone's trying to steal your bamboo sleeping mat or your kettle of fish? <laughs> <laughs> All I'm saying is, it's one thing being prepared for an attack against, like, each other. Whole nother story being prepared for an attack. I don't know, like, surprise! <laughs> Sorry, I can't do this. I'm just not an actor. That's right. You're not. You're a nurse. You're nurse with Trey. Joey. No, no, nurse with Trey doesn't know Joey. She doesn't have time for friends. She gets in that operating room and she carries that tray to the doctor because if she doesn't, people die. Who dies? Man with eye patch. <laughs> in there and you do your job. Yes, doctor. Okay. Okay. Let's try this one more time. Hang in there, man with eye patch. Your tray is coming. <laughs> and action. Yes, I did it. I nailed it. Wait, Rachel's pregnant? Yeah. Well, who's the father? We don't know. Oh. I wonder if it's that dude. There's a dude? Yeah. Who, who is it? Well, about a month ago, this guy spent the night with Rachel. Now, I didn't see who it was, but... Was that story over? <laughs> The guy left this. <gasps> oh, my God. I know who the father is. <laughs> People have got to finish their stories. Hey, my sweater. I've been looking for this for like a month. had a little wine, we got to talking, and next thing you know, out of nowhere, Ross comes on to me. <laughs> that's, that's a little misleading. <laughs> what is The lie you just told. That, that you came on to me? That's the one. But you did. I mean, let's be honest. Yes, let's. 
You know what? Uh, it's it's not important. <laughs> What's important is that is that we're having a baby, and it's not it doesn't matter who came on to who. Whom? <laughs> That's right. You know you kissed me first. What? What? You were begging me to kiss you. You what? you you were sending me signals all over the place. I was sending you signals. Yeah. Oh please. Okay. Anyone in this room think that I would actually send Ross begging signals? Please show of hands. <laughs> you know, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what people believe. What matters is what happened. Okay, well, so these signals, Ross, explain this to me, because maybe I need to be more careful. I mean, am I sending you these signals right now? You know what? You know what, Rachel? Just, just drop it. No, please, show me how I begged you. I can show you. I have it on videotape. In about ten seconds, you're going to see him kiss me. And in about five seconds, you're going to see why. Ross, did I ever tell you about the time that I went backpacking through Western Europe? <laughs> hey, get ready to see some begging. <laughs> oh, you came on to Ross! <laughs> what? Now I'm so happy. <laughs> Christmas be snowy, Joey. Happy New Year, Chandler and Ross. Spin the dreidel, Rachel. Oops, that's great. Oh, yay. But, you know, uh, Rachel doesn't rhyme with dreidel. I know, but it's so hard. Nothing rhymes with your stupid name. Oh, what are you talking about? Lots of things rhyme with Rachel. Bagel. Mayol, jail, bail, cable, maypole. All good, thanks. Um, do you maybe have like a nickname that's easier to run? Didn't your dad used to call you Pumpkin? Oh, yeah. Pumpkin, yeah. But did he ever call you like Budolph? <laughs> happy, happy Hanukkah, Chandler and Monica, Mary, Mary. Well, you know, you know what, Phoebe? I'm not Jewish, so. So Ross doesn't really decorate his tree with floss, but you don't hear him complaining, do you? <laughs> Went to the store, sat on Santa's lap, asked him to bring my friends all kinds of crap. <laughs> Said all you need is to write them a song. Now you haven't heard it yet, so don't try to sing along. So don't sing along. Monica. Christmas way.